you know what it do? It's Cop TV back at y'all with some breaking news. We got an update on a Chirac gang member that goes by the name of King Lil J. Uh, a lot of people been calling and DMing me like crazy about this. Uh, it was breaking news that King Lil J was spotted ganging with FBG Duck's mother, Miss Lashina Weekly. Now, a lot of people thought that was weird. I don't see why it was weird to them, but a lot of people said, you know, Cloud TV, why is they hanging together? Remember what Duck said about Lil J? And I was like, what did Duck say about Lil J? <clears throat> I had to do a little research and start mingling with the internet, you know, and what the internet told me is uh, Duck said that Lil J did some bogus stuff to him, some real bogus stuff. Uh, Duck said that he's not going to put the business out there. I believe he told Vlad TV this, if I'm not mistaken. He said he ain't going to put the business out there, but he said it was so bogus that nobody would ever mess with this guy again. Uh, he said that he was going to actually die with that secret. Rest in peace, FBG Duck. Uh, he never told the media or anybody what that secret was. Now, I don't know what Lil J did to this guy. But he even said on camera that Lil J was shysty and, uh, you know, basically just did some foul stuff. And I believe uh, an interviewer asked a rapper this question, why did Doug say that? They couldn't really answer it. And uh, we can't really answer it, but we know that a lot of people was talking about Lil J. It's just so many rumors about this guy. They just starting to pile up. He got the Geechee rumors. You, you, you got the, the setup rumors. Then you got the, the rumor, the big secret FBG Duck is holding, you know. Then you got the uh, the, the rumors with him and King Yella. They falling out. <clears throat> well, they didn't fell out. They dissing each other in interviews and everything now. So <clears throat> maybe King Lil J, I don't know how to put this, but maybe... Duck was right about King Lil J uh, as far as the shystiness stuff because I don't understand how could you be beefing with that many of your brothers now like I said we just the bloggers we don't know what's going on like we basically outsiders looking in but it is information that is publicly documented these guys get on live and argue with each other for the real to see the Twitter beef everybody's seen those beefs typed out publicly so it's not like nobody you know, breaking in their house, going through their phone and looking at this. No, this is publicly documented. This is on YouTube, everywhere, all over the internet. Anybody can see it. We just think that that's kind of strange for King Lil J to be beefing with some of his closest homies. And I've seen King Yella and Lil J make a few songs uh, together. Even on that, uh, the hot song, you know, uh, Lil J, he, what was that? The, the, the Bobby Schmurder Hot Nigga remix. King Yellow was on that. You know, that's when Lil J was walking around with the Mac in his backpack and shit, you know? So it's just kind of hard to believe that these guys is beefing. <clears throat> uh, the question of today, do you think Lil J is a shysty friend? Do you think you can trust Lil J as a friend? Y'all let me know. That's the question of the day. Make sure y'all subscribe to this channel, bro. It's Comp TV, and we out of this thing. Gang.